We have now come to our final topic, which is the microscopic anatomy of arteries and veins. In this image, you're looking at an artery on the left and a vein on the right. For the purposes of this lab, you can ignore the capillary in the center. We are looking now at the walls of arteries and veins. The walls of these blood vessels consist of three layers or tunics proceeding from the lumen side out. The innermost tunic is the tunica intima, also referred to as the tunica interna. This is the tunic that's in direct contact with the blood. You have this simple squamous layer of epithelial tissue supported by connective tissue. Notice that you have a layer of elastic tissue in the artery, giving it more elasticity compared to the vein. The second and middle tunic is the tunica media. This is where we have the biggest differences in the walls of arteries and veins. The tunica media consists of smooth muscle, but the smooth muscle is much thicker in the tunica media of the artery on the left compared to the vein on the right. This gives the artery a much greater degree or ability to vasoconstrict and vasodilate. It also contributes to the overall greater thickness of the wall of an artery compared to the wall of a vein. Arteries have to be more elastic than veins. They have to be able to stretch and recoil as the ventricles contract and relax. So we also find a little layer of, of elastic tissue in the tunica media of the artery. The last and final tunic, the outermost tunic, is the tunica externa. It's basically the same in both arteries and veins. Its purpose is simply to protect the deeper layers of these blood vessels. The final structure I would like to bring to your attention is found in veins. In veins, there's very low blood pressure. So there's very little pressure gradient driving blood through the veins. So to prevent the backflow of blood in the veins, similar to uh, the prevention of backflow in the heart, Veins have valves. You will not find valves in arteries as there is a, a greater pressure gradient driving blood through arteries. Valves are only found in veins. After examining the components of the walls of blood vessels on an image, let's move to the model. Here we have an artery in the center flanked by veins on either side and the walls have been dissected so you can see the various tunics. The innermost tunic is identified with the yellow arrow, the tunica intima. The middle tunic, tunica media, identified by the magenta arrow. Notice the smooth muscles. Notice they are significantly thicker in the artery compared to the vein. And the last tunic, the tunica externa, is shown by the black arrows. Also notice the valves of the vein.